The C-SPAN networks bring you long-form public affairs programming from the nation's capital and are a public service of your television provider. C-SPAN, created by cable. We put out a statement today. We watched this, and it's impossible to watch this gross incompetence that I watched last night. And we put out a statement a little while ago, and these people are going crazy. <laughs> they won't report it properly. Shall I read you the statement? <laughs> Donald J. Trump is calling for it. Now, listen, you got to listen to this one, because this is pretty, pretty heavy stuff, and it's common sense, and we have to do it. Remember the poll numbers. 25%, 51%. Remember the poll numbers. Okay, so remember this. So listen. Donald J. Trump is calling for a total and complete shutdown of Muslims entering the United States until our country's representatives can figure out what the hell is going on. You have no choice. We have no choice. We have no choice. According to Pew Research, among others, there is a great hatred toward Americans by large segments of the Muslim population. Most recently, a poll from Center for Security Policy Released data showing 25% of those polled agreed that violence against Americans — these are people that are here, by the way. People are here. 25, not 1 percent. By the way, 1 percent would be unacceptable. 1 percent is unacceptable. 25 percent of those polled agreed that violence against Americans here in the United States is justified as part — think of that — as part of the global jihad. They want to change your religion. I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't think so. Not going to happen. As part of the global jihad, and 51 percent of those polled agreed that Muslims in America should have the choice of being governed according to Sharia. You know what Sharia is? 51 percent. Sharia author authorizes — and, I, look, this is — I mean, it's terrible. Sharia authorizes such atrocities as murder against nonbelievers who won't convert, beheadings, and more unthinkable acts that pose great harm to Americans especially women. I mean, you look, especially women. Tough stuff. And we have a president that won't even mention the term. And you're talking about numbers like this. Mr. Trump stated, without looking at the various polling data, it's obvious to anybody the hatred is beyond comprehension of such a big portion. Where the hatred comes from, and why, we will have to determine. We're going to have to figure it out. We have to figure it out. We can't live like this. It's going to get worse and worse. You're going to have more World Trade Centers. It's going to get worse and worse, folks. We can be politically correct and we can be stupid, but it's going to get worse and worse. Until we are able to determine and understand this problem and the dangerous threat it poses, our country cannot be the victim of horrendous attacks by people that believe only in jihad. These are people who only believe in jihad. They don't want our system. They don't want our system. And have no sense of reason or respect for human life. They have no respect for human life. 